Ian, a good win against Newcastle in the Papa John's Trophy tonight. How do you assess the game? Yeah, a rough start. Um, didn't started the game quite well, but then we shot ourselves in the foot as we, we've done at times this season and given away two really sloppy goals. Um, but the most pleasing thing was the character, desire, um, the effort was there for all to see and to come back and win a game from 2-0 down is excellent. I think Mark Isles has told me it's the first time since 2012 that a Bolton team has come back from 2-0 down to win a game. So it's good. Uh, not so good that we were 2-0 down in the first place, but pleased with the result. And you must be especially pleased with the character tonight because at one point it did look like it was going to be Newcastle's night. Yeah, exactly, and I think it would have been easy for the lads that haven't necessarily played consistently in the, the league team to feel sorry for themselves. They didn't, and that, that was excellent. Their, as I said, their attitude, commitment, application was there for all to see, and they deserved to get back in the game and, and win the game. It's a bit of a cliche, but winning games, it's a, it's a good habit to have, and ultimately you must be delighted that the team have managed to get that win tonight. Yeah, of course, we want to win every game we play in, there's no doubt about that. Um, we've, we've lost too many games here this season, we want to try and make this a bit of a fortress. Difficult without our magnificent fans, we know, but also we can make it difficult for the opposition by the way we play. As I said, we've got to stop giving teams a start, but as I said, really pleased with the attitude that to come back from 2-0 down is excellent. First starts as well for the club for Lloyd Isgrove and Sean Miller. Great to see them out there from the start today. Yeah, firstly, um, it's great to see them in one piece. Um, and it's great to see they came through the game with no problems. They'll only improve for, for minutes on the pitch and, and fitness. The two young lads that came on as well, Mitch Henry and uh, George Thomas, and they did well as well when they came on, didn't they? Yeah, please. Mitch has been doing well in the youth team, so you know we want to try and develop our own and give him a chance. George, me and Peter, my assistant, have, have loved from, from day one. He's got very good quality, lovely left foot, and he takes up some excellent positions. So we wanted to toughen him up a bit with men's football at Bamber Bridge. But now it's time to recall him with, with the lockdown and there not being any football at that level. Um, and give him an opportunity with us and he came on and did himself well, did very well. Back to back wins, a nice positive boost ahead of Saturday's long trip to Stevenage. Yeah, of course. Winning football matches breeds confidence, there's no doubt about it. And we've, we haven't won enough so far this season, but there's something that we want to change. It's nice to see that we've got the squad you know, fully fit mostly uh, and it's starting to look competitive for those shirts and that's how it should be.